Greetings everyone, Looney Farm Guy here with a new mod for uh, Wednesday, August the 24th, and this is Modern Cow Barn by Mephufs, uh, 9.54 megabytes to download, 18 slots on console. Um, so first of all, let's have a look at where you can buy it. Buildings, uh, no, sorry, animals, animals, cows. And uh, there, there it is, the modern cow barn, $150,000. Uh, left and right bumpers will move it incrementally. So you have to keep pressing it down. It will go little by little. So just so you're aware of that kind of, uh, it might take you a while to spin it around. Other than that, it places easily anywhere. Uh, you might want to also... Here it has uh, flattened an area, but the area it flattens in front of the feed area is uh, not very big. So if you're, in my case here, the ground is not level, it's going to do a little bit of this. You might have to do some um, landscaping around it in order to make it uh, a little bit easier to use. I have put a uh, manure heap here. It, cr it produces manure, no problem. <clears throat> All right, so particulars, 150 cows. Um, a cow husbandry in modern European style, it is said in the description. Now, <clears throat> uh, feed trigger is right there. <clears throat> Water is automatically um, um, supplied. Here is the animal dialogue button. And um, here is the milk output and the slurry output. We will test those in a moment. Now, uh, if we look at our um, uh, animal information, uh, milk capacity 33,000. Slurry looks like it's going to be about 100 and ooh, uh, so 150. I'm going to guess, and food capacity, 43,750 liters. Now, uh, did I say food? Oh, okay, uh, food is, yeah, so there's a, I'm going to say a couple of things. So, first of all, I know someone's going to comment on this when I say it, but uh, let me say something first. I play with one day months typically so uh, it's available to be used uh, it is a thing most I'm sure most people actually do play one day months if not maybe two day or something like that I don't know of anybody actually who plays a full 28 day month now having said that um, I test everything on one day months that's how I test these barns because Mm, that is basically the most extreme um, setting you can use for animal pens. Okay, so s having said that, 43,000 liters, 43,750 liters of food. I got TMR in there right now. It will not last a, mo a month. If I go to sleep, and w I will do that, we'll go to sleep and come back and it'll be empty and my, cow and my productivity will be at zero. <clears throat> I test all my animal pens that way because that is how I play the game and that is how some people play the game. So it is the most extreme test of a cow barn. Yes, maybe you should put it on two or three or four day mm, months uh, in order for the food to last. Well, I don't play that way. So <laughs> that's uh, so there you go with that. All right. So straw. Straw bales. Straw bales go in inside. Right? So, um, uh, we're going to test a to see if we can dump loose straw here. But if I put a bale here, no go. It has to be inside the pin. Now, there is no gate there is no access to drive a vehicle inside 
<clears throat> so either you're going to have to uh, get a straw brawler. None of these, I don't, haven't found any gates to access inside the cow pen. Uh, no lights uh, that appear, I don't, or doesn't appear to be any lights anywhere. So, um, what I'm going to do next is um, I'm going to go get, grab a trailer with some straw to see if it'll accept straw being poured in here. Uh, we're going to go ahead again and we're going to see. We got a, I got a hay bale and a grass bale to see if it takes that for food. We know bales work inside the straw bin. And we're going to test the, uh, the output of the milk and slurry. So we will see you in a bit. And so we are back. Uh, we have went ahead another. So my, my guess of 150,000 liters of slurry is probably going to be perfectly exact. So now you see we've got no food and... Um, yeah, the straw. Well, the straw, is, the straw actually lasts a little bit longer. Good news about the straw. I have a trailer full of straw here. And yes, you can you can fill a loose straw. As you'll see in a moment here. There we go. And it should appear... There it is. Straw will appear in the barn. <clears throat> and we will test the bale uh, acceptance of the hay and grass. Let's just toss that other bale back in there. Uh, so grass bale. Whoops. Oh, get that straw out of here. Get out of here. Uh, let's see here. Grass. Will it take a grass bale? Yes, so that's good. Yes, okay, so grass bales uh, are accepted. Uh, straw bales, you have to throw them inside or loose straw here, or you can use a, uh, a straw blower. <clears throat> Slurry uh, output, uh, the trigger has come up right here. Very nice and fills fairly quickly. All right, there we go. So that's good. And the milk trigger actually came up pretty good here. So not a really tough spot to get into. And it also fills um, fairly quickly with, uh, with at least this tank anyways. So in my final assessment of this mod, not that I usually give grades or assessments or anything like that. I usually just present them the way they are and you let you decide. However, just my personal opinion, I would not use this barn because I do play on one day months and it would be constantly running out. It would not be um, it would not be a good fit for my game style play. However, it may be a good fit uh, for someone else's style of gameplay. <clears throat> and that's the modern cow barn by Mephufs. Uh 9.54 megabytes to download. <clears throat> and 18 slots on console. I'm Looney Farm Guy, and remember, it's only a game. So, till next time, bye for now.